Hi guys, today we're starting chapter 9 which is on vector functions. So previously we have deal with the vectors in three space like we had x, y, z components so they were in three space but now we're moving on to vector functions. So vector function are in three space as well so we have an x component, y component and z component but the difference is that here the components will be in the function uh, of t. So here, this, the x uh, component, for example, it's going to be a function of t, so f of t, and here let's say it's g of t, and h of t. So it's going to look like this, like f of t, g of t, and h of t, r of t. So this is actually a vector function. So the definition of a vector function is a vector whose components are functions. This is important. Are functions. Let me write it neatly. Are functions of parameter t and here t in this case is time okay so you see here the x component and the y component and the z components they are all in the function of t so here the x component is f of t and the um, y component is g of t and the z component is h of t so they are all in the function of they're all functions like they're uh they are not uh, numbers so they're gonna be numbers if we evaluate them but like you have to know that these are in terms of functions okay now moving on to the graphing okay so this r is a function where the terminal points of vectors trace a curve in 3D. Okay, so RT is a function where the terminal point of vector trace a curve in 3D. So these points, if we evaluate this function, will give us points and which is going to be a function so for example this will give us these points and which will make a curve in 3d okay okay so an example of a curve in three space looks like this and here there is a vector that is pointing here to a point and it's RT so this RT is actually what I just explained to you f of t g of t and h of t so this is making a vector which is pointing towards a point so at a certain time and here there's another vector so it's the, here this is RT1 so this would be RT2 at another time and here at RT3, RT4. So these vectors are pointing to the curve and making this curve in 3D. So the thing is these vectors are these vectors are this curve that this curve is making but it, they are just keep changing with time and these vectors are not going along the curve. So these vectors are actually pointing the curve. Okay, so that was it for uh, this video. Uh, let's do some examples in the next video. Bye.